Halo sahabat kompas.com, sekarang ini saya sedang berada di markas latihan Persija di Sawangan. Di sini kita nanti akan berbicara dengan pelatih Thomas Dol dan juga wakil presiden Ganesha Putra. Tapi sekarang ini yang bisa kita lihat ada lagi ada sesi latihan tim utama Persija. Para pemain sedang latihan ada Syaria Nabi Manyu, ada Ma, ada Maman, ada Rico Simanjunta dan semua pemain-pemain tim utama lain berhubung para pemain Persija juga sekarang lagi latihan. Mari kita lihat ke dalam yuk lihat fasilitasnya seperti apa di dalam sini. Yuk ikut. Sahabat Kompas.com, ini kita sekarang sedang berada di dressing room di lapangan latihan Persija. Bisa kita lihat ke dalam. Ya, ini kita lihat seluruh barang-barang yang dipunyai para pemain Persija yang sedang latihan di luar. E, ruangannya luas, berase, e, penuh dengan ya ada refreshment juga, ada banyak perlengkapan sepatu bola dan lain-lain yang akan mereka pakai tentunya. 2 AC, kamar, ruang ganti, kamar mandinya juga luas. Ya ini benar-benar fasilitas kelas profesional ya bagi Persija Jakarta. Nah kalau ini adalah ruang pelatih uh, Thomas Doll. Bisa kita lihat di dalam. Fasilitas training center Persija Jakarta ini baru dibangun tahun lalu. Rumah baru ini terlihat mumpuni untuk menunjang kenyamanan latihan para pemain. Di tempat yang megah inilah macan kemayoran mengatur strategi dan berlatih demi asa mengangkat trofi Liga 1 di tangan Thomas Doll. Mampukah Persija mewujudkan ambisi tersebut? Ya, selamat sore sahabat kompas.com. Sekarang kita ber sedang berada di Sporty Special di markas Persija bersama tidak lain dan tidak bukan Coach Thomas Doll. Hi. How are you today, Coach? Uh, yeah, better than Saturday. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. yeah, we had a we, we, we had a good meeting yesterday yeah. with the guys. We spoke about the game because it was a Yeah, not was, ideal result. No, not yeah. about the result. Okay. Because you can lose a football game, but okay. the kind of how we played football, this is not acceptable. And the guys, they they know this also. Mm. That uh, yeah, we played uh, one of the worstest games since mm. I am here. I see. And um, now today we had in the morning already a gym session. Yep. And we prepare now the game against Persibaya. So the mood is good. <laughs> you know, important you speak. Honestly yes. and directly to the guys, because I, I mean everybody know that he he played not the, the best football. Yes, and uh, because also Persita Tangerang was not a good game yeah. from them, but yeah. they played a little bit more aggressive, and yeah. this was enough to beat us. And yeah, I mean a lot of teams they, when they play against us play like this, so we have to know this and. To put so, more insight. Is that a staple of your uh, coaching methods? Openness with the players, let them give feedbacks to you and you give feedbacks to them? Ma, for me, it's always important that we, we are very honest with mm. each other. That the okay. player, they know how to handle me also. Yeah. Because everybody is angry after a losing game. Yeah. But this cannot be that, that I don't know, that I'm not speaking for days with the guys. And mm. because... We are human, so yes. everybody can make mistakes. Yeah. And uh, yeah, no, it was a good meeting. It was a good video analysis yesterday. And yeah. now the focus is everybody know uh, we have to give a lot of more percent than than in the last yeah. game. Yes. And then we are we can win football games again. Yeah. So that brings me like to my second question because uh, the management like uh, give you target to win the title in in this season. But with the situation that's going on, with Ferrari situation, the recruitment situation, how 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 are things in general for you in Persija so far? Ma, uh, ma the targets, you know. I mean, uh, <laughs> uh, everybody can say 
it can speak about targets. Of course, yeah. it's nice also yeah. to win the 12th title, but you have to work also like this. And mm. the preparation was not good. I yeah. mean, also a lot of players, they came late. Yes. Preparation and uh, so it's, it's nice, it's, not, it's, 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 it's good yeah. to hear that the board and everybody has a lot of confidence in my work, yes. in the work of my coach team, in the player. Yeah. But we have to be always with our feet on the ground ah, okay. because it's easy to say something, mm. but you have to do this also. For example, we have not six foreigners in the, yes, in in the, the squad, yeah. you know, and Marco, he is now for six weeks out. Mm. I mean, we have not the second striker, yeah. you know, we have Sandy, he is now in the, with, the, with the army somewhere. <laughs> Uh, mm -hmm. Ferrari is with the police somewhere, yeah. the police academy, maybe yeah. they make a new film also. <laughs> and <laughs> and then we have Hitler. Aji, Aji yeah. played last, last season in the second league. I mean, yes. all the pressure is, is to, it's a moment by him, be, with him and all the other teams, they have foreign striker. Yes. And that's why I'm not satisfied with the situation. Okay. I have to be honest. Um, but we are working, yeah. we are working and uh, so the player, they know this and uh, yeah, now we missed also Hansamu mm. injured, uh, yeah, yesterday Reski had a problem with the ankle, so at the moment yeah. the football god is not on our side yeah. and, and that's why I don't want to speak about targets at the moment. Yeah. You know, you can speak about targets when everybody makes his homework. Yeah. When everybody works like you can be champion. But okay. this was, the preparation was not like this. Mm -hmm. We have to be honest. And now we have to do the best and to give yeah. the best. So uh, yeah. we will see what's happening. We have to think game by game. Yes. You, it's, it's so easy to say, oh, Pasicha, we want to be champion. <laughs> Ma, yeah. Uh, yeah, maybe... One day I want to be also, I don't know, to have uh, 10 houses also, I don't know, or, <laughs> yeah. you know, yeah, you, yeah. you can have a dream, yes. but this has to be realistic also. Yeah. We have a lot of young players, we have new players, yeah. a lot of players are not fit, yes. because Kudi was injured, mm. um, uh, Gaios came very late, mm. now no really preparation, that's why... Yeah. Uh, nobody has to speak about championship at the moment. <laughs> yeah, okay. No. So, this is your se second season. I, I, I want to know what your opinion on the development of the whole competition in the Indonesian Football League. Like, what's the difference between last season and current season, coach? Ma, we, we played now some games. Yeah. I think a lot of teams, uh, yeah, they, they had a good uh, transfer summer. Summer, yeah. They built up teams very strong. And uh, yeah, and we were, we are a little bit behind. So mm. we have to yeah we have to see also yeah. the next games. How is the situation? I mean, in the same time last year, after four games, we had also five points mm. because uh, a lot of player came also late. Yeah. The first game in Bali, we lose. Uh, yeah, preparation was so so, and uh, yeah. I think. The Indonesian football, I was surprised a little bit last season. I saw a lot of good games, mm. and, but I saw also a lot of games uh, not good. Mm, okay. I mean, when I saw now Persita Tangerang against Persija Jakarta, my, this was not a nice football. Mm, okay. And uh, maybe from, the, from, from Tangerang, maybe the... Uh, the aggressivity or so, this was okay, mm. but both teams, they lose so many balls, yeah. so many not really actions in front of the goals. Mm. I mean, we never shoot one time to the goal. <laughs> yeah. That's you why I, sp I spoke about, we need foreigner, but yeah. it's not possible more because the transfer window Those closed. closed. Yeah. Uh, because a football game, you, you, you have to score. Yes, definitely. Last season, we scored 30 goals with a foreigner. And... Uh, so the rest was 17 or 18 goals from our other guys. Mm -hmm. it's, not too, it's not enough to win a championship. Yeah. So everybody has to give more in the front to create more chances. Mm. And, uh, ah. But we could see also in the training session, we changed the rhythm. Mm. A lot of players, they had the development, but 
sometimes they come back to the old muster. Mm, and this can always happen. Okay. That's why it's so important also that, that our foreigner, mm. they are there, they give balance in yeah. the team. But when the foreigner, they have also some problems. They are not really fit. They yes. don't have a really preparation. Yeah. So then they are, they are thinking more for themselves in this moment because they are also not so good in the game. Mm. Then we have problems like in the weekend. Okay. So, no, and that's why it for me is important. We have a long training week now. Okay. And the player they have some minutes more in the leg for training, and we will see a completely different face on Sunday. I'm ah, sure. Okay. Cool. Willa, you can. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Maybe uh, speaking about the competition in 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 Liga Satu again. Uh, can you pick a few matches? Uh, in the Liga Satu contestants that might be quite difficult for your team to play against or any uh, opposition that has a special impression uh, when they come up about, against your team? Ma, I think it's, uh, everybody he play against Persija. You can yeah. see this when you see the videos also one week before. Sometimes it's a slow motion football and when they yeah. play against us, they give always more. Mm. I don't know why, but maybe in Germany it's the same. Yeah. When they play against Bayern, I'm, I don't know. Um, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's very, very, uh, very difficult mm. to play against every team, yeah. of course, because every team has, has always some interesting player yes. inside. And when we are not 100% concentrated, we will have problems like in the weekend also. Yeah. And this is not about better team or not better team. Football, you know, you have to win your duel. Yeah. And uh, ah, that's why it's, it's a lot of difficult games. <laughs> we have some problems when we play outside, yeah. also in the last season. Yes. Now we lose our first game in this season also in Tangadang. No fans. Jack Mania is not mm. in the stadium. No fans, they could yeah. also push the guys a little bit. Yeah. This was forbidden. So it's also yeah. not a advantage for us when we yeah. go to play outside and our fans cannot come. Yeah. It's also not correct. Uh, so, the rules, the regulations, you mean? Yes. Yeah. Why they cannot, uh, the security, I mean, how many police people yeah. we have here in the country, yeah. they cannot handle that uh, Jack Mania is in the stadium <laughs> in, yes. in Tangadang. We have to go with the with Panzer, with the tanks again yeah. to the football game. Yeah, the Barracuda, I mean, yeah. it's also not correct. Mm. We are sitting from the hotel <laughs> until the, the, the stadium, Steady. 30 minutes inside. Is this is yeah. 45 degrees inside. <laughs> yes. we, uh, we, we have also players, they are told, they are sitting there yeah. for 40, 45 minutes or more, or 30 minutes and more. Yeah. It's not a good preparation. Yeah. It's not good, you know. Now you are loving, I but you. I am the coach. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, yeah. this is, is not correct. It's the preparation ideal, is a yeah. disaster. It's a disaster. Okay. Believe me. And then we start with warm-up. And then Marco Simic get injured. Mm. So yeah, everything is coming at the moment together. Okay. It's not good. Yeah. One of your worst periods in, a co in your coaching career? No, last season was a lot of more. Last because season more when my national player, they were not here. The under-23 oh. player were not here. You know, and then the league stopped also for two months because yeah. of the tragedy. So, I mean, a lot of things happen here in Indonesia. Mm. And... Uh, yeah, were you surprised? We are used this already with the challenges that you faced for the last. Ah, this year? is the first time for me in my life that that, <laughs> that I go with a tank in the football stadium. No. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, yeah. also for the player, for the foreign player, it's not nice to play nice, football nice. like this. Okay. No. you know, maybe for the people from outside it's normal, but when you sit inside in this in, the, in this yeah. tank, it's not nice, it's not and you know you have to play football now. Yeah, I I, I mean when I I would be football player. I was thinking what I do here. Mm. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, it's not, it's not very not ideal, right? Willa? I don't know. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, that's maybe what you said, like the biggest lessons that you uh, learned in the past year as in Indonesian football. But maybe we kind of talk uh, outside of the uh, technical things. Uh, you certainly on the sidelines, you like to wear plain clothes. You like to wear just shirts, t-shirts? Is that 
because of the humidity. Ma, because I have the whole week, I have the Persija shirt on the <laughs> trainings. <laughs> and then for me, it's, yeah. it's, you know, I feel well with my private things yeah. when I go to the game because the game is always something special. Yeah. And uh, in the weekend, I had something from Persija, but <laughs> it was not lucky. <laughs> so we lose a game. I mean, in the weekend, maybe I don't put this here. Oh, are you that kind of superstitious? So superstitious guy? Yeah, no, <laughs> no? normally not. No, normally normal not. I, you know, I decide this always. Yeah. In the uh, in the game day, uh, uh, mm. I put the color. This is for me. is not so important. Only only okay. that I feel well. Okay. You know and. Is for me was never so important. Sometimes I like to stay with, with sporty things. Sometimes mm. not casual. Yeah. Yes, but I am also in the age now. I can do what I want, and it's <laughs> not, I'm not more 20 years old. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So that means not look. that I don't love Persija because yeah, I don't have don't the, the shirt. shirt. Yeah. So no, no. I mean, this is is not important. Okay. <laughs> How many tattoos is <laughs> your body? Ma, I think about private things. Mm. Uh, I don't want to speak because mm. this is private. Okay. Um, okay. It's not interesting for nobody. Okay. And uh, so. Okay. Mm, okay. No, it's also mm. not. It's not important. Okay. Well, I think it's more the sporty things are important and the rest we want to keep a little bit secret. <laughs> okay. But I have a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, moving on, coach. Before the camera rolling, you said a few uh, words in Indonesia. How how is your Indonesian language oh, improving? No, I am very lazy with this. Very, <laughs> very lazy. So, yeah. ma, for me, it's always important that I, I every day I learn more words in English also. Yeah. But I like to to listen the your your language. It's very nice. Bahasa is is a fantastic uh, language with with nice words also. Mm. When I hear my player, when they play, when they speak, between is very, very nice to hear. Yeah. So I, I would be happy when I can, yeah, when I can speak some sentences more, yeah. also to understand something. But uh, yeah, at the moment, what's more important uh, we, that we learn English. Yeah. We have an international coach team. Yeah. International so country. it's no time to speak Bahasa yeah. between us. Do you have a Bahasa Indonesia teacher, maybe? Or? Um, no, no. <laughs> no. But our our assistant coaches they are Indonesian guys Indonesia. also. But it's it's, oh, it's very difficult. Normally you mm. have to sit every day one hour, two hour to to write <laughs> to also write, yeah. some words and to learn also some words okay. and yeah, but. We are lazy. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for this. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. What, what is your impression of Indonesia food? Any food? Ah, ma, I, 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 I eat everyday rice. I never rice. ate rice. You never ate rice before ever, in Indonesia? Never, wow. never. Oh. Only pasta or so. Now, yeah. every day, I eat rice. Um, yeah, we have to be a little bit careful. When we came, we were eating a lot of times also outside and uh, mm. we had some stomach problems. Okay. But it's not because the food is not good. Is it spicy? <laughs> maybe. Spicy food? No, spicy. The guys, they eat spicy. spicy. Me not. Yeah. But maybe somebody cooked this different or, oh, okay. and we were a little bit careful. Okay. And um, yeah, uh, when I think about nasi goreng yeah. or, yeah. or yeah, yeah, also other food, yeah. Is, is, is very special. One day I was sitting with the board on the table and we could eat with the hand also. <laughs> the hand. So for me also new because normally we have yeah. the fork and the knife. Yeah, uh, yeah it's very special. Very okay. special. Very good food. And the first uh, time when I was in the hotel, we went a lot of times in the Kemang area and there Kemang, was an yeah. uh, Indonesian restaurant. Yeah. So I was a lot of times inside <laughs> and uh, always good. Oh, yeah. I mean, we had only one pitch until mm. last year. Okay. They prepared this here also for the Youth Academy. Yeah. It's fantastic because uh, sometimes in the afternoon, now, thanks God, it's not so much rain. Yes. But I remember, so October, November, also start of yeah. the year was a lot of uh, yeah. afternoon was raining. We had to cancel training and to come inside. Oh, I see. This is a big one touch that we have something. Of course, you cannot train too 
too yeah. long and too often here because it's also not good for the legs. Okay. And now we build up another pitch there. Uh, it's not yeah. not at the moment not ready, but I it's think in some there. in some weeks it's ready. Mm. Yeah, Pasicha, do something. <laughs> you yeah. know, it's, it's it's good to see, and uh, yeah, step by step. Now we are waiting also for for our machines for the gym. Okay, the you gym, know, yeah. and and other things also. So step by step. Uh, okay. things what we need because I told you in the morning we were in the yeah. gym in Jakarta normally we can do everything here oh, okay. because it's the more place ideal. is there yeah. and uh, we are waiting uh, that the machines are coming mm -hmm. and then we can also our, our, our gym session we can do here ah, I see so uh, how would you rate the youth setup here and the youth setup in procedure and how do you balance like the team's demand for a win and giving those youngsters a chance well, I think youngsters, they decide this alone with the performance. Okay. And then my, I liked always to see talents also. Last season, our team was not so, uh, we had not so many players. Mm. And uh, that's why we asked sometimes to use somebody from the Youth Academy to come. And then we saw some interesting player. And of course, we don't send them more <laughs> away because... Yeah. Uh, they could, could help us also in some games. Yeah. They can have a development. They can play some minutes. I mean, also experienced player. they are sometimes injured. Mm. Foreigner are injured. Yeah. And, and then you, you have to use your time when you play. You have okay. to show that you are ready. And everybody in the end, he decides this alone. Okay, I okay. give them the chance. We open the door, but they yeah. have to walk alone. Yeah, into the door yeah, and uh, yeah and they can make mistakes also it's not a problem because they are young oh. they can learn yeah and yeah we are open for this yeah do you like have any messages for young people who are in the PSG Academy trying to break into the first team do you have any messages for them well not only for for our player yeah. also for other in players. general because the most important thing is that you put your heart okay. on the pitch that you are that, that you want uh, to learn, that you go yeah. with motivation on the pitch, that you want to get every day better. Yeah. Because we have also a, a lot of young players, they are lazy. Hmm. They think oh, everything is, is easy. And, yeah. But football is fighting. Football is duel in offense, in defense. So, and then is coming the technique and all the other things are coming out. But first of all, yeah. You get, you need a good own motivation. Okay. This is the most important thing, and yeah, maybe in the last years changed a little bit, because in my time or also the time later, a lot of guys they played always outside on the street, oh, so in the football, park, yeah. and they learned a lot on the street. Now they are more with the computer, <laughs> yeah. with the phones. Yeah. Uh, communication is different. Yeah. Everything is in internet and, you know, and this is what we miss a little bit the last mm. time. So the last years that is also, I mean, in Jakarta, it's not so easy to find a place, fields, yeah. a football field. And then the temperature is very, yeah. it's very hot. And uh, I mean, uh, this is very important because they learn a lot also when they play between, when they are young. Yeah. You know, in they're the playing now or, in yeah, yes? just the, the consoles. A good motivation is, is very, very important. You know, you can be always a friendly guy, but yeah. on the pitch, it's you have to be... Different, yeah. It's completely different. It's different. You have to have character, right? Yeah. Yes. So, uh, PSSI appointed uh, Frank Wormuth as their new technical director. Uh, what do you think maybe of his arrival? Do you know him? Yeah, welcome. Uh, it's a German guy. <laughs> and um, yeah... Is a is absolute top man. Yeah. Is a, I think he 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 trained coaches also in the yeah. in the academy to to get the pro license. So he has yeah. a lot of experience uh, in theory in praxis. Mm. Now the last years he was successful in a small club in Holland in mm. Almelo. Also mm. he make a great job. So I hear only positive things and. Uh, I, I'm sure that the Indonesian League, that the Indonesian Federation, that they will profit from profit him, from, from yeah. the experience. Yeah. Uh, 
Um, he can help also coaches. Yeah. He can give his input, mm. uh, insight. So I am happy that he is. He is really a top man. Okay. And I am happy that came not somebody. He has already the career behind him. Mm. Uh, he is somebody. He want to change really something. Okay. You so know? Do you know him personally? No, we never met. But okay. I heard a lot of good, good things, things good from. Things. Colleagues, they, they, they get the pro license, uh, they worked yeah. with him, uh, and uh, this, is, yeah, this is very important because he, he, he was never working in the Bundesliga or mm. somewhere, but he, he knows everything about uh, football, yeah. he knows about pressing situation, he, he knows about the defense work, he knows about how you have to be with Uh, to handle a football team, yeah. how you have to be with a single player. So he can give a lot of inputs uh, for, the, for the federation. Yeah. It's, very, uh, it's a, a very interesting uh, man. Yeah. And I hope that I will call him now, then maybe <laughs> today yeah. also. Uh, he, he's maybe Without. already in Jakarta. Mm. Yeah. Okay. To meet him also soon. <laughs> <laughs> so it's nice to have uh, someone from German to... From Germany. Yeah, for, uh, yeah, I'm happy that a really good man <laughs> and a really is good coming. Person. Okay. And not somebody yeah. I don't know, he's coming with, only yeah, with dodgy background. Yeah. So uh, in what aspects do you think Indonesian football can learn from German football coach? Well, <laughs> too much. I think it's, uh, it's it's not so important also to learn from German from or from German? French, from English. Okay. Because I mean every every country the mentality is different. Okay. I, I am happy when I see my guys every day in training. Okay, the, the game in the weekend was a disaster, mm. and they know this also. But when I see them, how they are coming every day here, they come, mm. um, yeah, with motivation. They yeah. like to train, they like to learn every yeah. day. And, you know, I mean, Hans Samu and Rico and, and uh, also Andri Tani and so, they, they were already out from the national team and <laughs> from the view. Yeah. And now they are in the focus, they are back yeah. also, and they could show yeah. to everybody in Indonesia we can play football because the season before was not good. Yeah, okay. And, and this, this is good to see the guys they want to learn, the guys mm. they want to make the next step. And it doesn't matter yeah. you are 29 or 30, you can always learn something. Yeah. Agree. You know, and uh, yeah, I have an Italian assistant coach. I am German. Yeah. The goalkeeper Both. coach is from Czech. Wow. The yeah. athletic coach is from Cyprus. So the roots from Scotland. <laughs> and everybody bring input into okay. the team. And I think the guys, they, they know this also. And they can learn every day something. Okay. They are happy oh. to train. This is my feeling also. And, and to make the next step. And okay. yeah, we can help them. Okay, well, one last question. Uh, maybe one last question. Uh, are you interested in managing our national team maybe one day, Indonesian national team? But they don't have a, a trainer, or a coach? No, they one have day. A coach. They have a coach now, yeah. Ah, okay. Maybe one day after coaching? Ma, maybe... No, my focus is Persija. My okay. focus is Persija. And, 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 and when Persija, when they say one day we cannot see your face more, <laughs> uh, you never know. You never know. You yeah. never know. Because yeah. now I know already the, the mentality of Indonesian, from, yeah. uh, from Indonesian. Yeah. I know a lot of player, also national player. So okay. it's a very interesting team. And they want to In make the also the next step. <laughs> Why not one yeah. day? Because I am young. No, I'm not saying <laughs> <laughs> but it's always difficult to speak about this also because I am under contract, yeah. the coach is under contract, I don't know, and this is not in our hands. Yeah. And um, so we will see yeah. always because we are living in here and now yes. and not in the past in the future, and not yeah, in, in the, the future. future. So we have a lot to do here. <laughs> okay, Coach <laughs> Thomas Dahl, thank you so much You're for welcome. your time. You're welcome. Afternoon. Thank you. Thank you. Thomas Doll telah mengutarakan berbagai tantangan yang ia hadapi pada musim keduanya di Persija Jakarta. Namun, ia dan jajaran pelatih kubu Persija juga terus mengorbitkan pemain-pemain muda terbaik dari Akademi Klub. Hal ini membuat kiprah macan kemayoran di bawah polesan pelatih asal Jerman itu selalu layak untuk dinantikan. Musik